What's going on? This is Game with Ski, and today I am going to show you how to play couch co op games on your PC together. I guess couch co op, but also splitting them between monitors. And these are games that aren't even. Um, made to be couch co-op games that you can actually play them as couch co-op and it's a program called nucleus co-op so i'm going to show you how to download that all right go to your browser and type nucleus co-op n-u-c-l-e-u-s space c-o-o-p nucleus co-op and here we go and in the web i'm going to zoom in right here like this and right here this is the website nucleuscoop.github.io click that and all the way up at the top here there's a download so you download click the download and how come every single i have to zoom in every time so you can see, all right, and then it pre this. You got the Microsoft X86 or Microsoft X64. You probably want to do the X64 if you have a 64-bit operating system, which you probably should. I already downloaded it. So you're going to download it and install it on your C drive. After you've downloaded Nucleus Co-op, and installed it onto your C drive. Go ahead and double click opening it up. And then right here, there's a little pop up. It says OneDrive must be disabled. So make sure it's not, make sure you do not use OneDrive. I don't use it. I don't ever use OneDrive. And honestly, I don't recommend using OneDrive. You're just giving your data away. So I double clicked it to run it, okay? And then this is what it kind of looks like. It's like you get a window here, full screen. It's kind of hard to see since I'm on 4K. But in the top left here, if you click add new game, there's a list here and this is all the games that you can use Nucleus Co-op with. And you can scroll through the list. You look at all these awesome games. You got Halo, Master Chief Collection, Call of Duty, Minecraft. and a bunch of other games. Um, one thing to note though, with the Halo Master Chief Collection is you have to have it installed versus via Steam. Now this was really confusing for me to figure out how to get it to work. So that's why I'm gonna go through step-by-step step on how I got it to work. So you're gonna go in this thingy and you're gonna click install. Once your game is installed, it's gonna appear here on the left of this screen that pops up and right here it says halo master chief so i'm going to click on that and you get to this screen here and you can see it's kind of like you can't see much it's like a really big screen i'm gonna i tried to sh i've tried to shrink it down and it just doesn't doesn't work good is get your controllers and turn on both of your controllers and I wonder if both my controllers should have been on already. I don't know. We're going to find out if they should have been on. Nope. Okay, it works. So I press a button on the controller. And this is player one. And I'm going to put that here. And then I press and hold the button on the other controller. And I have to move it here. Now, one thing I forgot to do. So I'm going to cancel this. Actually, I'm going to show you here. So I'm running my main monitor at 4K. And then this monitor here, it's showing where my monitors are. And that is running at 1080p. But the problem is, is this cannot run. You cannot run two different resolutions. All your monitors have to be the same resolution. So I have to go back and change my monitor resolution to... 1080p it does not work for doing it in the game you have to change your desktop resolution so i'm going to do that right now so i'm going to x this out i'm going to right click display settings and i'm going to change this back down to 
1920 by 1080p and I'm gonna keep changes. I changed my desktop resolution to 1080p and now I'm going to rerun Nucleus Co-op, if I could find it. So uh, yeah, I hate I hate how Windows scrambles your icons. I wish they had like zones or something where you could put things in the zone on your desktop. Wouldn't that be awesome? And it stays in that zone. Here it is, here's Nucleus Co-op. So we're gonna rerun that again and I'm gonna do it again. It's just telling you that warning pops up every time. And I'm gonna click on Halo Master Chief and see, I have this problem here. So you have to shrink this down. I gotta move it like this and then shrink it down smaller and move it up. So now we can see the whole thing. Okay, we're gonna go back to our controllers and I'm gonna press and hold a button on each controller. Now we got player one and player two, player one here, and then you click and drag it down. Next thing, it took me a while to figure this out, but there's an arrow here. We go to the arrow and it moves over. It's right here, it says unlock all armor, skins, emblems, yes. And this is the important thing where it says online mode, status disabled. Just leave this at status. Don't change that because it makes it so that it does not work. So just leave it like that. And now we're gonna press play. And now we're gonna wait and it's gonna flash and move things around a little bit. So I'll just talk some, yeah, it, it's just a little thingy pops up here, but now it's gonna start going. And then it's, do you wanna allow, you have to click yes. Oh, and you know what I didn't do? I didn't open it as and run it as administrator. We'll see if it works, but we'll see if it works. I forgot to run it as administrator. So you got to right click and run as administrator. usually well it looks like it might be opening yep there's the second window that's popped up over the first now what you notice is there is both Sounds of Halo playing simultaneously, so we'll get to that. All right, I now have both Halos on my screen, so it actually worked, but if it does not work for you, make sure you right-click and run as administrator on the Nucleus Co-op. Okay, I press start on each controller both of my screens are going to be nearing like the same thing okay we're going to go through the options on what you have to do to get this to work you are going to go to options and career and you're going to go to settings and for video, if you're having trouble, whatever you do, always make sure that window mode is set to windowed. It cannot be full screened. I tried full screen accidentally one time and I had to manually power down my computer with the buttons. So keep that in windows. For UI, gra for graphic quality, I keep it all, everything on enhanced mode. Oh, keep that on windowed. Don't accidentally change that. Okay, next thing you're going to do is go to network. And for network, that makes make sure that says LAN, local area network. And now we're gonna press B and save settings. I'm gonna redo that. I'm gonna do that now on my other one. So I'm gonna stop here for a minute. Okay, I just mirrored my local area network settings on both controllers. Now what we're gonna do 
is player one, you're going to press X. Or player two is anyways. You're going to press X and you're going to join the other player's session. So you'll see what it looks like on the right top right of the screen. If I press X, you can see my game session is here. But I only see myself. On this two player, which the screen you cannot see, I press X and I can click and join player. So I click, so I pressed X, join player. And now I am with player one. It doesn't show it on the player one screen though. But I am, it shows it on player two screen. So now if I press quick start. Let me go back here. Let me try again. All right, let's try this again. Now it's working. So I had to exit back out to the menu and then go in. See, it says player one, player two. And I will show you that it works. So I have two screens. You can also have them both on the same screen. I'll show you how to do that as well. Maybe I should have done that. Then you could actually see it. Oh man, how do I... Okay, so there we are. I'll show you that I'll move both. So there's me. And now look. See? I'm moving both. So that's it. We're both playing. That is how you play. I'll go over it on sharing. So you could also do it where you both share the same screen. So I'll do that next. So let me exit. I'm going to show you how to run the Nucleus Co-op on a single screen this time. We're going to right click and click run as administrator. Yes, I should have done this in the first place. That's just saying that that little pop up came up saying uh, OneDrive. Whatever. Now, if this opens up like a really huge window, you can just shrink it down from right to left. We're going to click Halo Master Chief. And then here, you can click this window, and I'll show you all the options there. All those different screen op size options. Here we go. We're just I'm just going to go like this. Press a, hold a button on the controllers for two seconds, and these little controller will pop up on each controller. Now you can drag it to your spot and then we go up to this arrow here we press okay and then it says unlock all i just put yes and then online mode status disabled make sure that says status and then we can click play okay i've tried different modes on that online play it just does not work now each game is going to pop up it could take a few minutes I don't know how fast uh, how much this how long it takes pertaining to how fast your computer is but I will leave the recording up going right now so you can kind of see how long it takes on mine it kind of pops up it's gonna wait a while and then it's gonna move it to the side and you don't want to press any buttons while this is happening don't press any buttons you can mess something up it's I think it's just running some kind of script that's manually doing that so you don't want to press buttons and mess anything up just wait till you have two full screen applications before you do anything a couple things to note though is we are going to have to we have two different sounds you can see the two you can hear the two different musics going so we're gonna have to shut down one music it's almost there. Don't do it yet. It's the full the windows are not covering the taskbar yet. And there we have it. We have two halos running. We'll press enter. Start on each controller. I guess you can have one person use the mouse and keyboard and one person use controller. I'm just gonna both do the controllers. And we have to do what we did with the other one. We're gonna go to options and make sure you don't change the 
display resolution. I accidentally did that on my first go around. Video, audio, gameplay, network. So you go to network and click LAN. Uh, you can see right here, LAN. Now we're going to press back and click save settings. And back to this main menu here. I will now grab controller number two. And do the same thing. Options. Settings. Don't touch anything on the video except for doing this. Don't go down to like window or aspect ratio or resolution. Okay, audio. Audio. So here we go for audio. You can either do game volume or menu music volume. I'll just do the game volume. So now we're only hearing the left main monitor screen. Network. Make sure we go to LAN. Press B and save settings. Now we're gonna get back to the main. So we're on the main menu. Now the player two, which I just was, I'm gonna press X and you can see that stuff popped up on the top right. Right there, where my finger's disappearing. Now I can click down to player one and I can press A. And right here it says join player at the top right. I press A. Now we are in the same thingy. I'll get back my other controller here. And I can click campaign, Halo CE anniversary, and quick start. Easy. And boom, we have both players joining. This is exactly what I did on the other one, except this time we're both on the same screen. I prefer to play, I like to have the whole screen for myself. This is kind of, it's kind of hard. I mean, everybody's got like a spare 1080, you know, these days, everybody's got a spare 1080p monitor. Heck, I got a spare 4K monitor right there. I'm donating that one to somebody in need. Okay, I could skip that and here we are. Halo remastered. Couch co-op on the PC using Nucleus co-op. See here I am again moving this one too. And that is all. I hope this video helped you. If this video helped you Please help me by liking and subscribing. I'm going to be playing Halo, the Halo series with my son. Um, pretty cool series. I'm going to play at Couch Co-op with my son here coming up. So I'm hoping to have some fun. That's not working.